Okay, hey everybody, it is, what the, f <laughs> I thought that was on my face, it's just something on my screen. It's Thursday, and you're watching Just So Random, and um, like I was saying, I had some uh, Linda classes, Linda.com classes, uh, for a Photoshop that I was taking, that I got, I don't know, probably like two years ago, that I, like I said, I only made it like 40% of the way through, I got all four. So, um, I started working and I kind of just like dropped it because, um, I wasn't doing my own Photoshop at the time. So I'm doing it now and I'm like, like I said, I'm feeling like a major lack of creat creativity. So I'm just going to, uh, redo those classes so I can like make some own project, make some projects myself, you know? So, um, I'm sitting here at my little workstation that I set up. This is what I, how I used to have it before Christmas and everything. Um. And I have my big monitor up and I have my laptop open and I'm going to watch the uh, videos and do step by step of the instruction and everything. And I got uh, Outlander playing in the background so that's what I'm doing today. I don't know what we're having for dinner. Uh, I love this show, I really do. I'm so happy they brought it to, uh, I'm so happy they brought it to TV because if they would have did a movie it would, they would not have done any justice. I'm just, I love when they do books like this and TV shows because they can have so much more content and it could, the story can be told so in depth. I just love it. Um, anyway, I got this track, tra uh, got off track. Um, me and Jack got into an argument over, uh, yeah, it's a medium sized one, over, um, he's taking Photoshop classes. So, yeah. He's taking Photoshop classes. I do Photoshop. I'm very, very good at Photoshop. So he asked me for some help and I kind of just took over and like 10 minutes into what I was doing I was like he's like you know you could have just did that and just showed me how to do it. I was like yeah I realized that 10 minutes I realized that 10 minutes in so I like finished up what I was doing gave it back to him. So then <coughs> like I said I was feeling for lack of creativity so I set up my little workstation and I went in to go get my mouse because I have found his mouse and hand him his mouse. And he wouldn't give it to me, so just started a big, stupid, huge argument over, over mouses. So, yeah. So I'm going to do this, and I will talk to you guys later, and probably in about an hour. It's only two clips from yesterday's vlog, so I'm just gonna throw those together, and put the, um, put the time of day on there, and just call it a day, and up upload that probably before eight o'clock. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. But I, yeah, obviously, I am feeling better. So, you can tell I'm sitting up and on a bed. So, remember that argument I told you guys about earlier? Well, it transferred over into another one. And... I'll just show you. See, Jeff doesn't want to be in this video because he realizes what he did was stupid and he destroyed a plate my plate but he also did this see that hole in my wall that got there because he threw One of these. My very nice plates. And it went. <laughs> but he feels better. He's sitting there smiling. He feels better. And now I have to look at a hole in the wall for I don't know how long. Okay, because Jeff feels better. Anyway, I am still downloading uh, the last uh, class for the series that I'm taking. I got the mastery, so I'll get all four certificates once I'm, five certificates once I'm done. So that's what I'm doing right now. I just got done watching a movie called uh, The Pregnancy Pro Project. I swear to God, the girl in it looks just like Alexa Vega older but act not nah, no nah, she doesn't 
She kind of does. I can't remember who she is. Can we pause this? Pause the... Download. Why? I'm going to use the phone. It's after 11. They probably closed. And we ordered pizza from Eurogyro. And a salad and some wings. That's how the argument started. Just... Mm. Just mm -mm. <laughs> start after the food got here, and I found out what his plan what his plans were. So yeah, but anyway, we got uh, I got a small salad. I'm supposed to get a small chicken salad, right? There wasn't no chicken on my salad, and that was a five dollar salad, and it was like it's the size of my camera, and I have uh, um, let's see, the size of my D80 with. No, no, the size of my D80. That's how big that salad was. It didn't have a piece of chicken on it. And I was just, uh, no. So, yeah. That needs to get replaced. That needs to get replaced. So, we're going to call him and just tell him, hey, give us credit. Because it's bad out tonight. It is. So, anyway. I was watching I was watching this movie called The Pregnancy Project. This girl, um, a Latina girl with a single mom and, a and she had a couple kids. Uh, the mom did anyway. So she's on a real student. She's, I think she was going to graduate valedictorian of her class. And they have senior projects that they need to do, all, every, uh, all the seniors. So she decided to do a social experiment and to see how people would re react if she got pregnant. Which did she think they were, uh, she wanted to know if they would like treat her just like every other pregnant teen, you know. Uh, blah, blah, blah. You're going to throw your life away. You're so stupid. Blah, blah, blah. And she found out that she was no, absolutely no different. People start stopped seeing her and just started seeing her belly. And at the end of the movie, she uh, had a um, assembly. And, uh, they had an assembly for her. And she got up and told everybody that, hey, this was just an experiment. And it, it, it was a good movie. I liked it. So now I'm watching Ring of Fire. It is the uh, opposite view of Walk the Line. So Walk the Line was Johnny Cash. The Ring of Fire is June Carter Cash. So that's what I'm about to start watching. And I'm playing Candy Crush. And like I said, I'm downloading. When Jeff gets off the phone, I'm going to continue downloading this uh, Linda Photoshop one-on-one -on -one mastery uh, CS6. And then I shall start my start uh, my classes all the way again from the beginning. It should take me about I don't know a month and a half to get through a ball. And I have a new Photoshop certificate. Yay me! So yeah, I will talk to you guys before bed. Doodles. How are you always at the end of your level, and I can never play on your iPad? Because I spend an hour and a half finishing the level. Send off some requests. This is. Okay. So it's the end of the night and we're in bed. There's the culprit on my iPad. Sorry for the bit of twang. It's going to take a second for me to lose it. That tends to happen when I watch a movie with a. Uh, it's, accent. it's so annoying because you know that that's not how she really talks yeah well it's not as thick as it was when after from when i visited my family down south for that three weeks she watched heart of dixie one night and it was awful whatever no when i came back from visiting my family in chattanooga i was talking like this for like day i think for like a whole month straight and wow. I, I don't know. You get down there and you're around that accent for so long. No. Yes. You get down there and you're around that accent for so long that it kind of just sticks. It's kind of like uh, um, Madonna. My glasses. No. It's kind of like Madonna, who is from like New Jersey, but has like a full on British accent. It's like that. She does that for attention. Whatever. No, she does that because she's immersed in that culture and that's how those people and that's how it sounds over there. So you don't hear it happening. 
You don't hear you don't hear yourself taking on that accent. You don't hear yourself taking on those mannerisms. You you don't. You just don't hear it. Uh huh. I'm sure. I can hear it now because I'm purposely doing it. But when you're down south for like an extended period of time, you do tend to say cold drink. No. You tend to say rich. No. Rich around there. North Carolina is not like is not like Chattanooga. It's it's not. Oh. Excuse me. Maybe those people talk just like that, but it didn't make me uh, talk like that. So, are you completely... Yeah, that's because you were surrounded by your family who were from Ohio. Yeah, but my sister does the same thing you do. Oh, I heard this accent. I'm gonna talk like that. Whatever, you're too. just jealous because you can't do it. No. Uh, I'm sorry, but a southern accent... You can be the smartest person in the world... But as soon as you start talking with a southern accent, people just assume that you're a cute drop. That is so not true. It, I mean, like, especially, like, a real thick one. I mean, like I said, some people are the smartest people in the world. It's just, it's a stereotype kind of thing that you just hear that and you're just obviously like, That is so oh not true. That and on top of that, anyway, I've been, I've been calling the people in uh, Southern Ohio and Portsmouth. You should hear their accent. They have that twang. They have that straight yeah. up southern I, twang. I will admit that if I do a Pennsylvania Ridge Runner impression too much, that I do end up talking like it. What's a Pennsylvania Ridge Runner? Pennsylvania Ridge Runner? Yeah. I don't. I don't want to start. Do it. I have no idea what that even sounds like. I, I don't want to start right now. What is maybe, it? Sound? Maybe in a minute, and then like I'll let you record it because I'll have to work on it. Alright, because when he at, starts, at first, I'm going to start at recording first I'll again. have to... Um, Say some words? Yeah, I'm, like, I'll have to practice at it, and then it'll start coming more natural. Well, anyway, we... A Pennsylvania Ridge Runner... Is, what, a moonshiner? Well... That's what I think that's of. That's what a Ridge Runner is, but not a Pennsylvania Ridge Runner. He's going to Google... No, runner. no, because you get a bunch of moonshine stuff. I'm try, I'm gonna try and find something. I've looked for it before years ago, but couldn't find it. Maybe somebody put it up. Well, anyway, tomorrow I will be cleaning the house and clean off our dining room table, which is a horrible mess. It's mostly just papers. It's still a horrible mess, and washing dishes because I haven't done that in like a day and a half. So everything. But I have one less dish to wash. You're welcome. Mm. Okay, I'll talk to you guys in a bit once he figures out this whole accent thing. Okay. Nothing so has changed since the last time you seen it. Nothing good night. has changed at good all. Night. And Jeff said he wasn't going to do the accent, so we're going to go to bed. Not right so, now. So we're going to go to bed. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Favorite. Check out any one of the social media links down below. Just, there's plenty of links. Just look at them. That's all you need to know. He's a jackass if you, today. If you've watched the show before, you know what they are. So just look at the links. Check them out. Check out the links. We will say goodnight and talk to you guys tomorrow. Good night. Good night.